What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today I am gonna do this exhaust tip right here that I got. It's a little bigger than I wanted, but I think it's okay. We're gonna put this on uh, on the stock pipe like so. Let's see if I can slip it on there. Matthew, what are you doing? Is that cool? Little bro, a hey, little bro. <laughs> can, excuse me, can you move? Okay, thank you. I think maybe it'll be kind of like that. I don't want it to stick out too much and the clamps right here will clamp it down. When I ordered this exhaust, I thought it said pretty much uh, 275 through 375. And that, for some reason I thought this was gonna be 275, which is two inches and three quarters. And this is gonna be 375, three inches and three quarters. But apparently not. This is this basically fits uh, 275 to 375 pipe, and then it clamps down right here. But it's okay. Uh, I'm gonna put it on. It should be fine. It's gonna. It's not gonna look that bad. And then, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna probably cut off this much of the stock pipe, so it's not actually sticking out all the way over here, right there. And then after I install this, I'm gonna do some uh, drive-by sounds, acceleration from stop and so on. And you guys can see uh, and hear how she sounds uh, driving. Actually, I might push it in a little more. Maybe, maybe like that. What do you guys think? I think that's good. I don't want it to st stick out too much and look kind of goofy, but I think that looks pretty good. Maybe, maybe like that. I don't know. It's not a, we're going for the diesel look, right? We're going for that diesel look. So I think that's, that's ideal spot and uh, angle. So I'm going to mark the stock exhaust, cut off the tip and we'll clamp this on. Alrighty, let's get this done. All right guys, the tip is installed. You guys saw the cutting process and install was pretty simple. And uh, I like the cutting tool. The cutting tool cut the stock exhaust like butter. And this is the tip installed. I really like it actually. It may be a little bit too thick on this side, but you don't really see that unless you actually look under and see what's going on. But I think it looks good. I really like it. The angle is pretty good. Of course, Matthew's over there doing his thing. Matthew, what are you doing? Are you sleeping? No. no? Are you fixing my truck? Yeah. Yes, fixing my truck. Okay. Uh, typical mechanic, right? Uh, so it does look pretty good. I really like it. Um, here's how it looks like from here. The angle is perfect. Uh, it doesn't stick out too much. So now that that's done, I'm gonna get ready to go to work, but uh, I'm gonna get to work earlier, and then by work I'll find a spot where I can do some uh, startup videos and maybe some drive-by takeoff videos so you guys can hear from the outside what it sounds like. Right, Matthew? Yes. Yes. Matthew, thank you for helping me fix the truck. Give me a thumbs up. <laughs> Alrighty. All right, guys, see you in a bit. Here's what the truck sounds like on the freeway, going about 60 miles per hour right now. So you can hear the exhaust, but there's no drone. 
uh, and then I'm taking it up to 70. Sounds pretty much the same. So at 60, at 70, it sounds pretty good. 80 sounds pretty good. Let me take it up to 80, just so you guys can hear what it sounds like at 80. It's actually, maybe even gets a little bit quieter at 80, because uh, RPM's a little bit higher. My truck never goes into V4 mode, so there's no noticeable difference in sound because it has 35s on it, so that puts a little bit of more uh, stress on the engine, so there is no, uh, so it never goes into V4 because of that. So I'm even thinking about maybe even removing that valve um, in the exhaust because it, it's never really needed because the truck never goes into uh, V4 so it just kind of res restricts the exhaust for no reason so I'm gonna take a look at that uh, later and see if it can be easily removed without actually cutting off the pipe if that's the case I can maybe remove it and then plug the pipe uh, holes on the side that would be an option I'll check it out later and see how that looks and if that can be removed so now I'm gonna find a spot where I can uh, do some uh, revs and accelerating and uh, takeoffs and put the camera on the outside and you guys can hear what that sounds like from the outside from the inside it sounds pretty good not loud I really like it so let's see what it sounds like from the outside all right, here we are in the tunnel. Of course, we have to rev it up in the tunnel. Come on, let's go, guys. Well, it's the first time I see cops setting up cones. I don't know what happened here, but Seems pretty interesting. They blocked up both sides. Set up some cones. Huh. So here we go.
So I hope you guys like this video. Thank you for watching. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe, like the video, comment, and we'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.